Hello, it's Dr Jo Martin here with your behind the scenes tip for this week. Listen, the uh, tip today is how do I get more gigs? So many people come to me and ask me, how do I get more opportunities to speak? I've got a great offer, I've got a great product, I've got a great presentation that I've got together, but I just need more opportunities. So basically there's a few steps you need to follow. Step number one, you want to ask yourself, who are my target audience? What's your ideal audience and where are they already meeting? So really start by defining who it is that you want to be speaking in front of. That's step one. Step two is to brainstorm any and every uh, club, networking event, um, organization, whatever, where those people are already gathering together in a room. So sit down and brainstorm a list of where they're already coming together. The third step is then to, ask, uh, to select a few of those that are, that are low-hanging fruit, easy to get access to, easy to join, where perhaps you already have a relationship with them. They're going to be the best ones. And perhaps pick three of them. Take those three and find out who is the person who selects the speaker and organises things. So, find, so pick three and find out who's in charge. Step four is then to build a relationship with that person. So many people think, oh, I'm a speaker, I'm a great speaker, that if you just bowl up and with it, without any relationship offer your services, that, uh, that you'll get a gig. It doesn't work like that. The speaking business is a relationship-based business. I believe you have to build a relationship with someone before you go ahead and, and you know, have them on your stage or you go and stand on theirs. So once you've, create, once you've found out who's in charge, then uh, build a relationship with that person. The, the fifth step is once the relationship is in place, it's then about uh, you know, creating the opportunity to speak at that event. So it's not something that happens overnight. It's, something, it's more of the farming mentality. It's sowing the seeds, tilling the soil, you know, fertilizing, watering, and watching the plants grow. That's the best way to get more opportunities, build relationships with the people that are ho hosting the uh, events already. I hope that's useful. Get out and do that this week. Start brainstorming. Who is it that has your target market and where can you start? That said, go out and make lots of friends because that's the way to get ahead in the business. Good luck with it this week. I'll see you next week here at the Behind the Scenes.